I'm Old Sneelock. Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelock's Workshop. Over the years, it's been a practice of the shop to not have sponsors. Part of it was because I didn't want the hassle. I didn't want to deal with it. The other part was, if I put my name on something and say that it's good, I have to believe it. And that's pretty hard to do. Large companies have a tendency to blanket the market with all kinds of things. Well, rules are made to be broken. And I've found a product that uh, I can actually put my name behind. Now, they're not a sponsor of the show. Actually, they called and asked if I could uh, do a favor for them. They're going to have a Black Friday sale. And they wanted me to present one of the items that's going to be for sale and kind of get you guys opened up the idea of looking at them. So what they did is they sent me a package. I got it yesterday. Came all wrapped up in a big box and showed up on the front porch and I went out and got it before the porch pirates. Although I don't seem to have a problem with porch pirates. Perhaps it's the reputation, perhaps it's the neighborhood. Perhaps they just really don't want to drive clear out here to find out that we've got something. Let's hope it stays that way. The people who called me were from Burn. Burn is a company in Rockford and Lakeview, Michigan, up north of Grand Rapids. They're a family-owned company, and they hold their quality to a high standard. And they sent me this box, which kind of goes along with that. It's marked Handcraft, H-A-N-D-N-C-R-A-F-T dot com. Hand and Craft. And what's in it is an extension cord. Not just any extension cord. This is a really serious extension cord. I've seen similar ones none quite this robust. Nice little card in here. It says, thank you, thank you. No, seriously, thank you. Probably goes without saying that we really appreciate your business, but we'll say it anyway. We appreciate your business. Power is our passion. We love making things. And we love knowing the things that we make end up in the hands of people who care about them, like you. Connect to what matters. Wherever you go, power is important. Hand and Craft is all about powering your work, your play, your life. And because there are many ways to connect, there are also many ways to plug in. In other words, we have a lot to offer. So if we've created a product that really speaks to you, and it helps make those connections happen, we'd love to hear about it. Just tag us at Handcraft Home. Just tag us at Hand and Craft. Just tag us at hashtag Hand and Craft Home. After all, we do what we do for you. Now I've met the people who work at Hand. I've met. I've met the people who work at Hand and Craft. And I trust what they tell me. Then I look at the then I look at the device that they sent me. When I open the box. They have a nice little saying here. Nice to meet you. Your taste is exquisite, your eye for quality impeccable, and your style is flawless. I can see why we have a connection. Hand and craft. 
Well, it's very, it's very nice to be praised in that way. Uh, I don't know that I necessarily fulfill all those expectations, but I like to think so. It's seriously heavy. Why is it heavy? It's cast iron. It's not some cheap tin plate little stamped out plastic thingy. This is heavy duty. This is the Hand and Craft 26NC model iron hide. Kind of goes along with it. End. Amps 15 volts 125 hertz 60. Furniture power distribution unit. And this is some serious hardware. It has a six foot cord on it. It also has a 110 volt receptacle and two USB ports. Now, some of us old guys might actually think, why do you have two USB ports? Well, because these days you have lots of USB things. I do a lot of things with USB ports. For one thing, my phone charges with a USB port. Now my phone's charging. And my Samsung notebook, well, pad, also charges with a USB port. Yep. There's still a 110 volt outlet in case I want to plug in uh, a light or pretty much anything. Even in a workshop as well equipped as mine. I find myself every once in a while running just a little bit shorter reach. Now, what better to have than an extension cord? Especially one that's really robust. Cast iron housing, wire braided wrapped cord. Three prong grounded outlet. Three prong grounded cord cap. Three cord grounded cord cap with a three cord grounded cord cap. Cast iron housing. Nice to have an extension cord, especially one with a cast iron housing. Little rubber feet so it doesn't skid off the workbench. The cord wrapped in a braided wire sheath a three prong grounded cord cap with a 90 degree bend on it that's turned 45 degrees so that you can put multiple ones in the same outlet. Now 15 amps. Just exactly how much is 15 amps of power? This is a 9 inch Hitachi grinder. It's rated at 15 amps. That's some serious muscle. So all in all, I gotta say I'm impressed. It's a nice outlet. Nice cord, nice cord cap. Having the USB ports on there, that means that I can not only be running the grinder, I can have my cell phone charging at the same time. This would be great in an office. You've always got that outlet behind the desk someplace that you can't get to. Six feet, that'll get you out where you're away from it. It's a nice solid box, heavy. So when you put it on top of the desk, it'll stay there. You can plug in your phone and your laptop and your USB port fan or anything else you want to plug into the two, two USB ports. And then have a 110 volt outlet to plug in maybe your coffee maker. Oh, all gotta have coffee. This is made by Hand and Craft. It's a nice device. 
they have a lot of other things on their website. There's a link to the website should show up about here. And there'll be a, another link in the description that you can click on to or just enter that into your computer or cell phone. I like it. So this is the only thing that I have recommended with the company knowing that I did it. So it's a big departure for Old Snelox Workshop. Thanks for watching. If you have any suggestions for a new video, questions about today's video, or any of the other videos on the channel, just drop a note in the comments. You know I read them all. Burn provided the outlet to me free of charge, and my son works at Burn.